Next video. Got a little introduction to it I want to do for you here right now. It's a video about innocence. Lost innocence. I'm trying to recapture that feeling. That feeling, that moment of innocence. There was this church when I was a kid. Little kid. We used to go to. We lived, uh, we lived close to the city, near 8 Mile in Detroit there. This church was out in Troy. It seemed so far away, like it was country. And I remember the grass would grow so tall that in the late summer and the fall, before they'd cut it, when the wind would blow, it looked like water, it looked like waves. And I just remember, like I can see that in my mind to this day. And I just remember how cool that was to me. My great-grandparents used to go, sometimes my grandparents, sometimes my aunt and my uncle. It was quite the affair. And uh, great-grandparents would go with me, or with us, and uh, I would get to sit with them, sit with them in the in the pew, and, and Grandma always had a peppermint patty or a, a piece of dentine to share with me, dentine gum. And we used to record the sermons, record them on a tape player that looks just like this. I actually bought this. Uh, this is not the one. We wore that one out years ago, but I bought this uh, when I ran across it one day because it's the exact same tape player that we used to record the sermons with. And I'm so lucky and so fortunate to still have some of those sermons. And I just remember the innocence of going to this church and how everyone just, it was like family. Like we would have gatherings at my house and you'll see a clip in this video and pretty much the whole church would be at my house for these gatherings. And they'd sing and they'd play guitar. My dad would play guitar some. His friend Gary would play guitar. There were other guys would play guitar and the tambourine. Once in a while, they let me play the tambourine. And I just remember just the, the closeness that everyone felt. And these sermons, or these church services, I should say, I got some tapes 90 minutes long and the tape ends before the service does. We'd sing. We'd go around the room. Everyone would get a chance to talk about something going on in their life. Good. Give the Lord thanks for something. They do prayer requests. They pray. There'd be a message. They'd sing again. <laughs> 90 minutes, two hours. Church services. Again, the innocence. I don't remember the dogma or the theology. Pre, post, or mids. I just remembered the camaraderie and the love and no one was worried about going home or getting to lunch. The preacher didn't apologize for going five minutes over. Probably looking back at it through some through some romantic lens of some child that remembers it a certain way. And maybe to those that lived it that were older and were adults it was different. But to me that was a time of innocence and everyone has an innocence somewhere in their past how do we get back there how do we touch that how do we feel that again i'm not sure you can the song says that it's a long time ago i'm not just talking distance or years the years put a distance the miles put a distance life puts a distance between today and that innocence and then the song says but on nights when i'm sober and not blinded by all that I've seen, my mind rushes up to that church. And those nights, I cherish those nights. This is one of those nights tonight. It's really, really late when I'm recording this video right now. Very late. Early in the morning, put it that way. But I'm remembering that innocence. And I had to put this video together. I wanted to do this before my dad passed, and I just never got around to it. You hear a clip in here of my great grandfather and my great grandmother both giving their testimonies and asking for prayer. You ever listen to older people pray? I remember it was at my grandfather's house, my pa, my pa Charles's house up in Kentucky before he passed. This is not that long ago, just a few years. My aunt had made some dinner and we were going to eat. We were visiting for the day. And my pa says, Let's say grace. <laughs> he prays for his kids, his grandkids. His great-grandkids, and for safe travels for my family and myself to get back home. 
Oh yeah, he happened to mention thanks for the meal at the end there. But that was his prayer. And when you hear my great grandma, she's praying for her family. And when I talk to my mom and I hear the tears in her voice, she's praying for her family. And before my dad left us, passed, this last couple of days when I was talking to him, he's just telling me how much he's praying for his family. So what matters is as close to that innocence you'll ever get is the family, the love, the comfort of the family. And you're praying for that family. So we're going to listen to this song and got some video clips of days gone by. Innocence. Just trying to capture a little bit of that innocence. We always do it. I wore my Happy Day shirt on purpose because... That was the time with that innocence and that show. The Tigers hat, my papaw, papaw put me into baseball, got me into baseball. It was just a sport. It was just a game. I didn't know how much they made. It was just a game. And me and papaw watched on the TV. The innocence. How do we touch that innocence again? Jesus said, come as a child. It makes so much sense. When you really think about it, just come. Come with your faith. Come as a child. The innocence. So songs about innocence lost and how to capture that moment every now and then. I hope you enjoy the video. Thanks for watching. The armor of God is the girdle of truth. Next week we'll be looking very closely at the girdle of truth. It's a girdle, it's a belt. Next... Next week, next week's the girdle of truth. If everybody, I hope everybody comes. My favorite memories, some of my first. Like a Sunday night in me, an old country church. Sometimes my grandparents would come and take me But old country church house on Gaylor Creek We all knew our neighbors, everyone there was friends And the preacher worked the timber like all of the men We were baptized by water We were washed in the blood I don't remember much money But recall lots of love That church was a long time ago Talking distance and years Not for certain But I could even Get there from here But all nights when I'm sober And not blinded By all that I see My mind washes up At that church On gate
That old honky-tonk highway That's a wild horse to roll Son, I've seen enough neon To circle the globe That church was a long time ago I'm talking distance and years I'm not for certain that I could even get there from here But on nights when I'm sober and not blinded by all that I can see My mind washes up at that church on Gator Creek Mine washes up at that church.